Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to GIS World channel. Today I would like to show you how to import the shape file into the PostgreSQL database without the QGIS. So first of all, you must go to the here search and just shape and you will have the PostGIS bundle a tree for PostgreSQL and by double click you will have it here PostGIS shapefile import export manager. And if you just follow the installation, the first video as I uh, show you in the uh, PostgreSQL PostGIS playlist, you will have it automatically if you just follow the installation uh, instruction. And if you just uh, go to the here view connection detail, username, uh, Postgres, and here the password, what you define. And here, uh, server host is a local host, and port number is OK. And the database I already defined here test underline project. And if I just OK, you see connection succeeds. So, this is the time to add the shape file. And if I just come here and just uh, find it uh, one shape file uh, from here. And just here, state of Germany open, and here you can define the schemas. Here, I already did the public is by default, but I would like to add it in the test one. And here, you have this option and to change the table name. And here, SRID what is the SRID? SRID stands for the special reference identifier, which is the parameter in the OGC standard and is consist consistent with the. EPSG code. It's a and the common one is the word geodetic system and the WGS84. And here the number is uh, 4326. So it seems everything okay. And it's a, here we have the option, and you can uh, you have some by default option here, but you can define some more option according to your project and interest. And after that, just uh, it seems everything okay. Just import and the shapefile import complete. So let's go to the PostgreSQL and check our result. So if I just come here, refresh, and just going to the table. So it seems the table is here and view the rows. And I would like to check the geometry if everything is okay. So great. We already have the uh, state of Germany here with the uh, correct uh, coordinate system and uh, it's done. So right now I would like to show you how to export, you know, to take some, some post.js layer that we have already in our database as a shapefile into our uh, local system. So as you see here, we have again the uh, post.js shape shapefile import export manager we already make a connection and here instead of the import we will go to the export so so for, so here is the add table the table in the postgreSQL database add table and you can define for example exactly the same table that we already imported and just okay you see the uh, table and some other information and we have some some option here it's up to your uh, case and here if I just export it will be pointed where you would like to you know save it for example and I would like to save it here for example and open for example here open and it will be added table export uh, completed so, and uh, I, if we check uh, uh, the uh, here let's check and if I go here you see here the data as a shapefile has been added and saved. So I hope you enjoy from this video and it will be helpful for the following video sometime. And you do not have the QGIS for the import and export of the shapefile into your database and this video uh, and this uh, technique will be really helpful for you. Thank you very much and see you soon.